can't tell what this video is going to be by the thumbnail or by this gigantic thing behind me, this is going to be a video all about the Rev Air blow dryer that you guys have probably been seeing all over the internet and I was gifted one of these um, by my boyfriend for Christmas and I wanted to make a video on it for you guys. So I've used it once before but I was kind of rushing and I wasn't able to give it as much time and attention as I wanted to so this is going to be the real first effort that I have using this blow dryer as well as like actually blow drying my hair for the blow dry look in a very 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 long time. Without further ado, my hair is freshly washed as of last night and I put these twists in overnight to help with the drying process so that my hair wouldn't need to go straight from soaking wet to blow dry. And I saw Natural 85 doing this online. I'm going to start off by putting my twists in the blow dryer and seeing how that works and then unraveling and going from there. I just want to show you guys um, how this process goes. Uh, my hair is already moisturized as of last night. I put in a moisturizer leave-in. Let's just get right into it. I'm going to put on the high heat instead of low heat which is what I discovered last time. The actual sucking part of the machine has um, one through seven. Last time I put it on six. twist feels really warm I'm gonna unravel it it would be a really 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 cute twist out but we are not going to do that I think I'm gonna split this in half just to see if I can get you know really smooth results here a lot of different steps you can do to make sure your hair is smoother in the end so I'm going to really take the time now. So I'm realizing already I probably put a little too much shea butter, but at least my hair is going to be protected. It's probably going to be a little bit oily. I almost never detangle my hair. Okay, let me rephrase. I never detangle my hair with tools, so it's always such a weird step to me that always feels like overkill, but when it comes to blow drying, you do want to make sure. What I'm also going to do is like a really, really quick trim as well. Um, my hair really needs it. I'm a fan. It's flowy and soft. I'm a fan so far. After I bring the twist back together, that section, I do another quick trim as well. So I'm not taking off much. I think from postpartum shedding, some of the, like, the last couple of inches of my hair have been not ideal. Really, really loose twist. Uh, get it out of the way and on to the next one.
so that was the last section. I'm so excited to see what this is all going to look like. Oh, my hair is so soft and even though it was really, really oily um, from the shea butter, it, it actually, I think it helped to be a good sealant, also a good protectant. Um, and even though it's weighing down my hair a tad, I'm okay with it because it's helping my hair not to have as much frizz. And it's going to be humid today and tomorrow, so this is going to combat that as a really great preventative measure. You guys can see that I like, did a really, really good job. Got a really good trim. Just a little bit of tingling. I'm a fan. I think it looks and feels great. Let's do the part where I normally like it. I think it's great. Um, it took me about an hour, including recording and everything. Definitely a fan of this blow dryer because it's just like, you guys saw me doing it like this and that, but even all that is just way easier than having to use a regular hair dryer with the brush or attachment or whatever. Um, that is just way more work and it's just like zoom in so you guys can see roots. And the roots got pretty handled as well. You can see a couple kinks, I'm not too concerned about that. But the roots are smooth. I did a really good job with that. guys I really really like it the results are really cute um, I'm gonna be playing in this a lot I think hey that's the blowout look so thanks for watching guys and I will see you the next one mm -hmm.